rapping like I'm not killing When you know they got bricks in the street And the country club bricks in the action plan and meeting on 95.5 WFRK the freak well you way I thought about what you said about not having enough experience with modern media so I hired an urban promotions firm to help get the word out uh oh was that bad did the bulldog just predict this <laughs> did the bulldog just predict the black girl twerking at the MLK monument. <laughs> Everybody want to throw their two cents in. I just want to throw my two cents in. And the two cents is this. Uh, uh. Bulldogs predicted it. <laughs> and another thing. Y'all want to do this shit for Michael Max. <laughs> He'll come out the grave and slap somebody. <laughs> Man, y'all some real shit. Y'all <laughs> real <laughs> I don't want to really talk too much on it. Like, ain't nothing wrong with twerking. Ain't nothing wrong with expressing yourself through dance. But usually, back in the day, when they did dances and tribute to MLK, now, like, this is what I seen growing up. It used to be um, dancers from all over the world. And, uh, you know, like, it'd be African, it'd be Australian, it'd be like a whole bunch of other, like, cultures, you know, like dancing in the name of the culture of MLK. But this shit, <laughs> I feel like throwing some money. <laughs> I'm just saying that this shit is laughable. You know, and a lot of people, you know, saying that Black Lives Matter has a hand in this. So let me know because, like, I'm hearing from both fans saying Black Lives Matter don't promote it. Black Lives Matter do promote it. Just let me know because, like, Black Lives Matter is... um look like they're the forefront of this twerking on the, the MLK thing. So, y'all let me know in the comments. So, this is boy Hurricane giving you two minutes for a form with the boondocks <laughs> predicting this shit. <laughs> Peace.